Hello, hello. So, I'm just starting to copy some files from today's photo shoot. It's the boring stuff. I said I'll be live at 11. It's 2258. I'm just starting to copy the files. And reporting, it's the uh, nasty stuff. Just take a minute. I hope you like the sound. I like to, to follow Paul Mahuda uh, Lounge Beats. He's a very good DJ. I've been following him for a few years. And I like to share what I like. Follow Paul Mahuda, he's a very good DJ. From Brazil. So, importing imagery. Okay. Uh, wait, let me just uh, open my YouTube channel on my uh, mobile phone so I can check the chat online. Oh. Uh, okay, live chat. Here it is. Let me test it. If, no. Hi. If you want to chat with me, you can try here. I'm new at this stuff. Keep an eye on my cell phone. If you ever want to chat. So let's see the. Oh, just keeping the sound a little bit lower. Increasing my microphone. Okay. So let's check the image the images. Okay, first what I do is I I import all imagery. Before that, I copy the images from my SD cards to my HDD. I copy them from my Nikon SD cards to my local uh, hard drive. So I always have a first backup done for the first 24 hours uh, then I back up the final results to another hard drive but first I copy all the files to my hard drive I go into Lightroom I import them into a Lightroom catalog I've done that already and then I go in I select them all I haven't done any selection yet I just want to create a collection I always create files and collections with date, reference name, so I can easily look for them later. Okay, here are my images, and now, yes, okay, I'm um, gonna also open a second screen, a sec secondary display, okay. It's my left screen. I can uh, you can see my left screen too. Wait just a second. My left screen, yeah. So uh, you can see the images here. My f main screen, where usually I like to see them in thumbnails. Yeah, this is my computer, a little bit slow. Uh, 
Okay. Waking up to life. Um, this uh, photo shoot was. The location of the photo shoot was at uh, the Jazzy Laugh Club. I can maybe share with you the my left screen. Yeah. We shot this with permission at the Jazzy Life Club at Santos. Um, I just want to make sure that nobody else is shown on, on the pictures. If, uh, if I see someone that is not uh, expected in my images, I will uh, wipe them out. And very cool gym and after the shoots they made me train as well so I'm uh, I'm dead today but still have a few minutes to to do this image selection before going to sleep because I do need to sleep today okay so let's go let's move it quick pick Every image is that the strobe didn't work, didn't sync. That's the case. No flash with strobe, without strobe. So those images, I don't select them, I reject them very quickly. I don't have to uh, to increase the the size of the of the image to see if it is a good image because I already know it's a bad image. not shift just control hold just control okay rejected no face but uh, could be a funny image maybe I don't know I'll decide that later uh, yes strobe 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 no strobe but maybe I can pull this up I don't know uh, rejected this one this one maybe that one also let me check this rim light yeah funny image funny image the teacher Rose, 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 a very, very good teacher. I, I'll put the the Instagram links and Facebook links afterwards on my YouTube uh, link video. Very good teacher. Uh, focus on the images. Okay, this one clearly no strobe. Okay, this is a, a not funny image. No strobe, deleted. I do also want to protect my models, so I quickly delete image images that are not good. Oh, very very funny. Upside down. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, like that one. I want to do that again. Oh, big strobe in there. Uh, nope. Okay, this one uh, rejected as well. Also, if I see uh, out of focus, if I cut some heads or something that I don't want it to cut, 
if I see if the picture is not good, I immediately recheck it. I do, do not want to have garbage on my hard drives because let me show you what yeah I can't uh, focus on my <laughs> file explorer I'll deal with that later where was I oh very cool images yeah 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 I like it I have already boosted a little bit the colors. Here I was trying to uh, capture some movement. Yeah. No strobe rejected, not good image. And if I see that I have to shoot this again, I will shoot this again. The, the, the second part of the shoot will be with the uh, black background. We'll make the, the images much more artistic. This is more uh, lifestyle images. I'd like to go a little bit more commercial or more artistic. I have to, uh, to practice that a lot. For example, this image with no strobe, no extra light, no artificial light. Let me just check if with some exposure increase I can have something nice. Yeah, completely overexpose the background, but I don't really care about the background. I really, and in fact, I do like this. Uh, um, this white background, yeah. Kind of interesting. Can maybe crop this image later. Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? I'll deal with that later. Thumbnails again. Yeah, the teacher executing the uh, perfect. Uh, sorry, I don't remember the name of the figure. Perfect position, yeah. Damn it, no strobe here. Completely busted. Nope. Okay, got I have no information on on the dark side of the image rejected uh, kind of funny face uh, I'll deal with that later yeah big smile like it yeah, I like this image teacher and the student yeah Yeah, with some backlight because this job didn't work, but uh, I do like this uh, backlight effect. Let me check with some extra exposure. Uh, 
Nope. Reject it. I don't like the uh, the background. That went school. I will have to deal with this later. This is my uh, my softbox. Again, rejected. Rejected. Didn't sing the flash. Funny, I was trying something different. Kind of like the effect, oh, almost there. Okay. Just have to point uh, to, to, uh, to pull the point of rotation to her face. Strobe, let me check with some more exposure. Uh, nope. Yeah, I like that. Those are really not easy to execute. I tried some of it, some of them. Really not easy. Damn it, it's dark. Uh, couldn't have enough enough information in the dark side of the image so when we pull the exposure up uh, there is no information to pull up from the docks and there's too much red also in the picture and it causes this uh, strange effect Look, the lack of information here on her face is uh, too bad. Rejected. The strobe didn't sink. She was having a nice smile. Unfortunately, I have to reject this image as well. Okay. Funny image. Can keep it. So let's filter the image the images first. Uh, show me only selected image. Do not show me the rejected images. And I have 118 images. So Mario the colleague also here. I will reject nothing special. Well, look at the teacher, she is really good doing this stuff. Rosie. Uh, funny face. 
rejected. I like the teacher teaching her students. Rita, yeah. Kind of like the feeling of this image. Let me check this arm here. Extra arm. Uh, I've got a little bit the knee of the athlete. Teacher here is helping her, but uh, you just see the arm. I don't like it. So, sorry, you're gone. Oh, I've got Facebook uh, notifications running on the background. Okay. I usually do this second quick run to uh, to reject some photos or to select some special ones. Okay, I really have to make some uh, some video of this because uh, with still images we cannot feel the uh, the dynamic part of it. I think a video should really give more impact to the message we want to transmit. Okay, we have some funny faces that I'm trying to uh, eliminate. Okay, this one, for example, is rejected, funny position. Uh, this one, for example, let me think, let me see. We put on full screen. Uh, maybe rejected. I've got much better than this. Next time I should try with uh, at least two two, li two artificial light sources because um, sometimes I use the natural light that was coming from the windows, but uh, I also use uh, so much power with my strobe for some images that I completely kill the ambience, the ambient light. And uh, I really have to try this with uh, two, maybe three artificial lights to make sure that I have some rim light, some or backlight uh, in my pictures. Okay, I like that one too. I was shooting through the fabrics, trying to get some uh, cool effect, but I uh, didn't quite succeed. Let me just increase the exposure a little bit. One f-stop, maybe. No, we got too much light here. Uh, so reject it immediately. I do want to protect my models as well. Especially if I'm choosing the pictures live, I don't uh, uh, want to go full screen on every single picture. At least on the screen that I'm streaming, I have my second screen, my left screen. Yeah, where I uh, I'm seeing all these images in full screen. My left screen, you don't. Um, 
because I, I, I'm, I have to make sure that I uh, protect uh, me and the model and eventually some people that can appear in the photographs that uh, I don't have the permission to. Yeah, funny one, this. <laughs> Yeah, it seems it seems easy to do, but it, it's not. Uh, nothing special in this one. Can't see her face. Uh, same here. And we have these hands coming from nowhere, rejected. Oh, please make it work with some exposure. This image seems to be very cool. Yeah, kind of like it. Yeah. can feel my back <clears throat> they killed me after this session I trained with them uh, yeah I tried to do some crazy stuff I've done my first Christ <laughs> very bad Christ didn't succeed to uh, do and I hope that anyone took pictures of me doing that because it was really bad Okay. Exposure. Same thing. Let's see if this is something cool about. I'm a little bit worried about these reds. There is too much red and when we are at the edge of the uh of the color information like the reds we may get off track first because my screen is not show, showing me uh, the real range of reds the sensor of the uh, camera has uh, more capabilities to capturing uh, color information than my screen has to, to put them out and that's why I use a, uh, a spider for screen calibrating thing very handy oh and in fact in fact yeah he's running and I have to calibrate yes yes I have calibrated them but I have updated my uh, graphics card driver so I have to calibrate my screen again okay later And so because of that, I'll try not to uh, change the, the color so much because uh, what I'm seeing may not be the true color of the picture, so I have to be careful. So this one, for example, I'm going to reject it as well because one, the athlete, my model was not on the perfect position. We can't see her face. 
there's not so much movement in it uh, the texture is not sharp focused nothing good rejected bye bye yeah oh unbelievable I did capture Not easy to accomplish, I guess. Like it very much. This one I have to reject it, maybe. Yes, uh, you can't see her right feet rejected. Too dark, rejected. Nothing special, rejected. Nothing, nothing special as well. Rejected. I like this one. Like the mood of this one, the teacher helping her student. Even if we can't see her face, I do like because uh, the main focus here is the teacher. Rose, yeah. I like this one. In this image, she's not very sharp, but um, kind of like the mood. Maybe I can uh, get rid of some background. Maybe. Oh, this one too. Rejected. Those two maybe will be rejected as well, I don't know. Okay, I've been here for 30 minutes already. I have to, uh, to speed up a little bit. I don't like to take too much time selecting images on my first run. And I'm still uh, just rejecting the bad ones. Rejected. quality but uh, there's something in this image that I like and I don't know what it is I'll think about it later this one is a uh, is dark very dark increase the exposure uh, blowing the highlights on the background but I don't care about it it's not my priority Okay, she has movement in some parts of her body, including her face. The scarf is, the fabric is movement too. Okay, some movement, so uh, even if the straw was not synced in this image, 
by increasing the exposure manually, I do like the final result, kind of interesting. So this is the teacher, no faces, nothing else. Uh, I've got someone else on the background, people on the background. I don't want to show other people on the images, so rejected. Here as well, I see a face there. She's not uh, really focused or sharp. That's not a very good image. Uh, I don't know, maybe, maybe yes, maybe don't, maybe yes, maybe don't, maybe don't. Reject it. So. Now, from those 197 images, I'm going to color rate them by saying that all the pictures where I only see my model, the athletes, I will be, uh, I will rate them with red, for example, and all the pictures where I can see the teacher will be rated yellow. Very simple, but it's a easy, easy way to separate interest, I interests. Red label, yellow label, rejected. Uh, rejected. Still, when I'm uh, choosing images in the middle, if I see another one that for any reason I don't like, I reject the image and I don't think about it anymore. We still have lots of pictures to, to reject or to rate later. So. Like that one. Kind of like it. I've got her feet. Uh, and when it's funny, yeah. Don't like that one. Reject it. Okay, so yellow, reds, red, yellow, and yellow. Let's speed up a little. The red, 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 red. Those three are yellow. Every picture with just the athlete is labeled red, with the teacher labeled yellow. That, of course, because later I uh, would like to to give, check it, to work separately the images from the teacher and from the athlete. Cool image, that one too, and that one too, yeah, I like that. Yeah, so cool. So not easy to do. To execute, I mean. I really like that one. Rate 5. Thank you. 
Oh, wait. Ejected. Uh, that image had someone in the background. Not supposed to. Nothing special in it. Okay, so yellow selection only got 35 images with the teacher and or teacher and student. I'm sure I can pull up very nice images from here too. Here, for example, she's uh, clearly teaching something, some some technical stuff. Yeah, very good images here too. Yeah. I think she's gonna like it. Reds colored, red labeled. Forty four images to select a top five, top ten, top fifteen, maybe top twenty. So five star, top five, four star, top ten, top fifteen, top twenty and all the others similar and good now i'm going to uh, put all the images without filter because the, the reds are really strong here. No, rejected. Yeah. For example, yeah. I'll uh, apply the preset maybe later. Oh, I kind of like it. So thumbnails again. Let's just choose images. So I'm going to choose the good images. Oh, that one is a yellow one. I 
another yellow one. Yellow ones are the ones where the teacher appear. Ah, I got her hand, damn it. Rejected. Uh, what's special about this one? Nothing. Rejected. Kind of like that one. I will deal with the background later. Here's why. I've, first of all, I've got my my big softbox, big, not very big, but my softbox on the mirror. And also the teacher and the mirror is not very clean. So uh, I'll have to clean up the image. I, I can just clean up the background, and remove the mirror, yeah. That will take me about, uh, let me think, something like five minutes per image. Because I'll have to, to replace the uh, entire mirror with some uh, wall. Then I have to emulate the shadows. Okay. Yeah, she's happy, she's smiling, I like that. Good training. Just focusing on the... Uh, Strong rim lights, kind of like the feeling. Here she's uh, with a yeah, more peaceful look, do like it as well. I need to go to sleep. <laughs> I'm training a lot. Running, swimming, and now this too just killed me. Uh, that one, that one, maybe, maybe yes, maybe not. Not enough light on her face, funny face, maybe. Yellow one, we can see the teacher, she's smiling. Not too much light on her face, but uh, maybe we can. Uh, Fix that on post production later on. Color label yellow. Oh, the other one was a rejected one. Not in a flight on her face. Rejected. We can't see her face. Only that. Uh, is there any artistic quality in it? Mm, nope. Rejected. I can can accept that one. Okay, some movement again. Not in the flight, rejected. Damn it. Here I, we have similar images, I'll go on them later. I still have a few images to go on. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll decide later which one to choose from those. I'm too saturated right now to choose between those ones.
Okay. Those two are very similar. So let's compare them. Right one checked, left one rejected. Selected, rejected, yeah. I have to try that one, but uh, the point of rotation must be on her face instead of her chest or the boobs. Not the way to go. Rejected. Funny one. Uh, blurry face. Everything is blurry. Um, the hand. The only thing not really blurry is the uh, her hand. Nothing special. Rejected. Funny one, and cool one. Yeah. Like it. Okay, the first ones, the first ones. Nope. Yeah, why not? Well, no. No, she's falling too. Nope. Nope. And in this case, I don't really like the light. Her eyes are closed, she's focused. But um, we'll have to reduce the background light of this image. Don't really like that one. Well, I let the model decide. So, five star. One star or more, we have now 23 images, yeah. We still have a uh, lot of images that are very similar. Okay, okay, okay. That's not a five star image. One thing I'm going to do is uh, start downgrading the rating of the images. That's not a super cool image. That's just the first image. Well, I don't really see any potential on this one. Uh, bye. We like it. You like it? Uh, have to solve this background problem. <laughs> that softbox. Yeah. Shooting 
in places with a mirror without an assistant. Not easy. Let's say, uh... Oh. Sorry. I have to go to sleep uh, at midnight. Okay, for five more minutes. That's not a five star, that's... Uh, so every picture where she's uh, like smiling or funny or something that's not artistic, but it's a cool image, it's a lifestyle image. I'll rate them like one, two or three. Very quickly. Three, three, three. Oh, those are the pictures that I have to uh, choose between them. So we can uh, open the survey view on Lightroom, and now let's check on them. Now this, this image, this one, this one, let me check better. Okay, this may be the candidate. That one. Inject it. Down to three. Yeah, real. I like that one. It's a candidate. So that one as well rejected. Not as good as the other two. Bye. Something special about that one that I like. Not exact. Don't know exactly what. I guess it's the, the blown highlights that I like here. Uh, that one. Yeah. Like and like. That's a five. That's a three star rating. So first run three star, four star or more. So only the five stars. Eleven. I just I want a top ten or a top five, top five for five stars maybe. 
let me see how much there are. Okay, that's a five, that's a four, for example, because her face is not well lit. Maybe if she was on the other direction, it would be a very good image. A five star raking image like that, it's only a four star. I'm sorry. Uh, very artistic, I like it. Her face is not lit as well. And I really like to see her face here. Now she's in the direction of the lights, but we can't see her face very well. Four star, I'm sorry. I like artistic one. Uh, maybe, maybe. Have to work on the background. Uh, We have this shadow coming from her arm. Uh, first star, too much light here, I can correct this. Uh, gradual filter, to correct this, easy, easy stuff. Uh, like the mood. Uh, that one's yeah I'll have to downgrade it to three three stars two three stars as well uh, let's say four star maybe Five star pictures. Yeah, we have three, not five, three five star images. Well, that's only my evaluation. Her evaluation must be completely different, so uh, I'll be completely impartial with that. Those are my favorites. Four star rated two. I like them very much. Well, that's maybe a five star. Or oh, that one. That one. That one. I like that one. Five star. Three star images. We have a lot of them. We have 11. One star, three images. No, no star, I mean. Two star, none. One star, one. Three star, let's downgrade some images to two stars. On the go, on the go. Two stars. Two stars, funny images. Yeah, I like that one. Now here. Rejected. And uh that one has enough light on her face. That one don't. Uh, I kind of like it like this. Let me blow the the highlights on that one too. Yeah. 
Yeah, DJ Pablo Rudy is on the house. We are listening to, and that was what I that what I was looking for. Mojito launch beats, launch beats from Palo Ruda. I like the sound. Okay. Eight images, three star rated. Two images, two star rated. One image, one star rated. So rating is greater than or equal to one. All the images that we have selected reduced to 19 images. Nice. Now that I have the 19 images, I have to pause a little bit. My eyes are over such uh, are a little bit saturated, color saturated. So I've done my selection today, the day of the shoot. Tomorrow I will go through them again very quickly, and then I'll readjust all the the color grading for the pictures. So if that's the case, thanks for watching and see you soon for the next live.